Good morning, friends. Happy Saturday. It is June the 3rd. Yeah. It's about 10.15. <laughs> I just took my Wagovi, made a coffee. Rob and I were going to go to Dutch Brothers today. I know I've talked about it every day. You're like, Misty, shut up about Dutch Brothers. But I am having one of the side effects of <laughs> Wagovi. So we're going to stay home today, which is fine because i trying to do a crafty stash. If you're someone who makes cards, stamps, etc., I am selling a ton of things. I do that twice a year sometimes. It's been a while since I did one. So I'm doing that and then I'm going to put my face on to film. I'm going to film a weigh-in. And I thought I would do like a week in review video. You guys will have to let me know what you think of that. Like blood sugars, eating, maybe weight. I don't know if I'm going to want to weigh in every week. We will have to wait and see. But I thought, I thought that might work. So the noise you hear in the background is Rob on the treadmill. Did I say that already? He hasn't been on the treadmill since like mid-February. Because he had COVID too, right? And I think I told you guys, like, I almost feel like he got COVID worse than me. And so he just wasn't, like, he didn't have any kind of stamina to get on the treadmill. And I was like, then don't get on the treadmill. <laughs> don't hurt yourself. Oh, that one that is gone. It's rose-scented and ugh. But I bought a three-pack. So, yeah. So, selling things is on the agenda today doing some videos is on my agenda today that's why you see all this stuff out over here i need to film some videos for my misty channel if you are into makeup etc i do have a channel where i play with makeup pan makeup like to finish or hit eyeshadow pans i'm trying to hit Pan and 200 eyeshadows for the year 2023. And you're like, Misty, what is the point? Mm. <laughs> Just get some use out of eyeshadows. I don't know. I don't know. So that's really all I have planned today. As for food, I honestly don't. Oh, I'm going to make. So I never got around to eating salad last week. I ended up throwing it away. But I do have all my vegetables chopped up. So I, Rob bought me more salad yesterday. So the goal is to have salad. Maybe not today because we're going to try to go to Saltgrass tomorrow. That is a steakhouse. And if you have one around you, most of them have been, like we've only had one bad experience one time. And that that's been it. But I normally get the 16 ounce Pat's ribeye and I have them cut it in half and cook half medium for me to eat right away and then medium rare for me or rare for me to bring home and then I will have two different side salads so I'll have a side salad there and then I'll bring a side salad home they have um green beans but I don't like them They're too waxy for me and then do they have broccoli I don't remember they don't really have a whole lot of low carb options and I would just rather have a salad and then, um, yeah, so anyway, I'm going to have salad tomorrow. But one thing I've decided to do, <clears throat> and why I didn't think of this earlier, is I have a huge bag of broccoli, and I'm going to make broccoli salad. So it's really good. I think I use, uh, is it Wholesome Yum's recipe? I don't remember, but it's broccoli, mayonnaise, almost said mustard, mayonnaise, some white vinegar. You can use apple cider vinegar too, whichever one. Uh, a little bit of sweetener. I don't like mine pretty rarely sweet. And then shredded cheese and bacon. And it's actually really good. <laughs> it's actually really good, y'all. So I think I'm gonna do that and um, for some of it and then have the rest of it with just some ranch or I also have, we have one ribeye left in the refrigerator, not the refrigerator, in the freezer that I could cut up and um, make like broccoli, beef broccoli. Mm, these are so good. It's called the Yummy 
gloss from um color girl these are so good <laughs> like, i own like four of them because they're that just that good so yeah oh it sounds like he may be done so i am going to film the d-stash i'll let you guys know i'll put a post in the community tab or whatever when that's done then i'm going to put my face on do some filming like i said i'm going to film a weigh-in i'm going to film an update and then um there's not a vlog going up on Saturday, which you'll see this tomorrow, but there isn't a vlog today because yesterday I had the sinus headache from literal hell. <clears throat> and then, um, and I went to bed Thursday night with a, no, Friday night with a sinus, no, Thursday night with a sinus headache. Woke up with a sinus headache. And like I mentioned before, I still think I have, I still think I have sinus infection. So if in like, it's just right here. And it doesn't feel like I need it to drain. Like it doesn't feel, like I don't feel s congested, well until night, but I, j I just have a headache and it's right behind my eyes and it's like, oh, all right, all right, fine. So yesterday I just basically got all my stuff together that I wanted to sell, spent some time pricing, you know, doing those kinds of things. Um, what did I eat yesterday? Oh, I had a coffee in the morning and then Rob went grocery shopping yesterday and our Costco was right by in and out So he brought home in and out So all I had yesterday was a coffee <clears throat> and then around six o'clock I had um, two Flying Dutchman with grilled onions. So Flying Dutchman, you can get it protein style, but I honestly don't like iceberg lettuce. And then when you get iceberg lettuce and the burgers are warm, then you have warm, soggy lettuce. And I was like, let me try a Flying Dutchman, which is literally just two patties <laughs> with cheese. <laughs> sometimes I get grilled onions, sometimes I don't. But last night I had some grilled onions and then I um, had it with a side of pickles. And that was all I ate yesterday. Um, I'm happy with my weight. It's coming back down. I will probably lose a few more pounds today. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say about that. So yeah, anyway, I am gonna get back into what I need to get done and I will try, I don't know, how, what are we gonna eat today? I don't know, I, Rob, I made, I don't know if you guys remember, but I bulk cook a lot for Rob and I made him like 30 or, no, I made him like 55 meals at the beginning of like February. So I'm like, I'm not meal planning until you get all that done, <laughs> like until you eat all that. And, but I, oh yeah, I remember. I had him buy me some canned chicken the last time he was at Costco, not this time, but the time before. No, I got it from Sam, it doesn't matter. But I wanna try like the chicken nuggets and the chicken pizza. And it's so, it's so, I don't know, funny is the right word but i see all of these people on tiktok and instagram and stuff like try my chicken crust pizza and it was like no that's not your recipe that recipe has been around for like 15 years the same person who created the cauliflower crust recipe created the meat crust recipe and it's like i don't know i had this issue with matt and mega too when they first came on because it was like you could, that's not your recipe like give give people credit for their recipes, but whatever. I feel like one of those old ladies is like, get off my lawn. All right, that's enough jibber jabber. I will talk to you in a little while. Oh, um, blood sugar is like 150-ish. Ish, I didn't sleep very long. That's probably part of the reason. I couldn't fall asleep last night. Um. I just could not fall asleep last night. And I thought I felt, kept feeling like I was going to have a leg cramp. So I took some meds to help and I took them too late. So anyway, okay. All right, friends, it's just about 1.30. We are having Pollo Reggio. If you are in the Dallas area, it is delicious. It's mesquite grilled chicken. I have um, some keto wraps from Aldi. I actually really prefer the plain ones. I'm gonna have one, probably maybe two tacos. Roxy is also enjoying some chicken. Is that good, mamas? That's good stuff, huh? So blood sugar is 150 or 155-ish. So this is what we'll be eating for lunch and this may be all I eat today, we'll see. 
Okay, I finally got my Dutch Brothers. <laughs> I'm gonna be awake for like 18 days. It is 2.40, blood sugar is 1.39. So this is a sugar-free cookie freeze. So it's sugar-free white chocolate sauce and chocolate macadamia nut syrup. So we'll see what this does to my blood sugar. We'll see. All right, friends, it's almost 7.30. I'm just having some pork rinds with some of that ranch I made. That drink was not sugar-free, and I have spent the last four hours coming down from my blood sugar over 300. It's 146 right now, so yeah, I'll check in with you before I go to bed. Oh, hi, I did not check in with you before I went to bed. Oh, uh, what time? I went to bed early. I didn't, that... Having that so much sugar yesterday really, really flipped up my day, and I feel awful again today. My blood sugar was like 180 when I woke up, so we'll talk about that more in today's vlog. But yeah, that's it. So today is, I don't know what I'm going to do today. I honestly don't know. Like I said, I feel like garbage. But I know that I'm not going to do Dutch Brothers again for a while. Um, they had to remake the drink, and I think that was the issue. Rob said, well, I heard him keep telling the other person sugar-free, 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 but obviously it didn't happen. So, and I, I've mentioned before that Tarani syrup bumps me up, but it doesn't bump me up to 300. That's for damn sure. So yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys have a good weekend. I will see you guys tomorrow in the next vlog. Bye for now.